AT&T community. I've got a couple of things I want to share with you all. We're getting ready to have lunch, and I said I'm going to show you all this video. I'm about to make some, um, uh, what am I going to make? Some bacon ranch. Well, first of all, I'm going to make some bacon ranch, a bacon ranch, a chicken bacon ranch dip right here. We've got our sour cream and our ranch uh, dips. Got some cheese, uh, put parsley in there. And uh, the star really is this chicken, this rotisserie chicken that I got from Sam's. I wanted to get some fresh, um, not fresh, but some um, chicken breast. But my God, for three chicken breasts, it was like almost $15. And I purchased this rotisserie chicken, fully cooked in season, for like $5.48. So I think this was the better choice right here. So we're going to um, open up our chicken, separate it, and I'm going to make three things from this chicken because it's just that much. We're going to have a chicken bacon ranch dip. Then I'm going to make uh, some barbecue chicken ciders, and I'm going to make some buffalo uh, buffalo ranch chicken sliders. So I'm going to do six buffalo ranch chicken sliders and then six barbecue chicken sliders. And uh, what I'm going to do is go ahead on and separate our chicken and then we're going to put it in the crock pot for about an hour and let it cook just to um, to uh, get the juices for our barbecue in there, okay? So we're getting ready to get into this meal. Uh, some uh, We're going to have some dip and then sliders and uh, it's going to be good. It's going to be a good lunch. Also, hopefully you can get this idea and use it for your Super Bowl party this Sunday, okay? Hold your horses. <clears throat> okay, guys, I just want to show you all how Sam's really, that um, rotisserie chicken that they have is really amazing what you can do with it. This is like some pieces that I have left over. But this right here, the, this is what I shredded, and we're going to put this in the crock pot. We're going to put some um, barbecue sauce on top of this in the crock pot for about an hour, maybe 30 minutes, probably about 30 minutes, because it's already seasoned. We just want the um, barbecue sauce to get incorporated in there. So this is for the barbecue chicken sliders. And then this, is, this right here is the um, buffalo ranch uh, sliders. This is what I shredded. For the um, and we're gonna use our buffalo wild wings medium sauce for our buffalo ranch sliders, and then this right here I want to show you all. I use my ninja here, and I cut these up a little fine for our dip. Okay, still got a little piece right there, but I kind of cut that up fine for our dip because we're gonna put some more stuff along with our chicken. And then, like I said, look what I got left over. So I really can go back through all of this and put some more in there. Just want to show you all. So now, let me get all of this together and we'll go to our next step. Okay, guys, I want to show y'all I've got my oven liner here. Well, my slow cooker liner, not oven, but my slow cooker. So we don't have to make two big of a mess. We're going to put my liner in like this. Just like that. Then we're going to get our chicken. I'm going to use that for that. All right, we got our chicken here for our slow cooker. Shred it up. Got our barbecue sauce here. Put some in here. Just like that. And then we just gonna combine it. What I'm gonna do is put it right here in our slow cooker and let it kind of come together. a little bit just like that. I'll check it in 30 minutes. I have it on. Let's turn it on first. I turned it on high and we're going to check it in 30 minutes and um, see how it goes. Let me show you all. That's our barbecue chicken for our barbecue sliders, okay? 
And I'm that's uh, we're gonna put this to the side because the next thing we want to work on, and let me I'm gonna put this to the side too because we're probably gonna have to put a little bit more barbecue sauce on there once it cooks. But uh, we got it <clears throat> set on high, and we're gonna check it in about 30 minutes to see what it's doing. How about that? All right, let's move right along, let's keep it moving right here. We've got our chicken for our Buffalo Ranch chicken sliders, okay? Shredded these up, just wanna make sure. This is our Buffalo sauce right here. Let's see here. Get this open, okay? All right, let's put this to the side. And we're gonna put some sauce in here, like that. And then you put as much as you want or whatever, okay? When you're making your sliders, you put as much of your sauce in there as you want because you know what you like, all right? Now, I'm gonna put some ranch in here, like that. this morning and ooh, all kind of stuff. All right. Let's see, this is our bacon ranch. I mean, buffalo ranch sauce. Okay. Now, we're going to step it up a notch. Put a little cheese in here. cheese. Okay. Let's mix this up in here like this. Okay. Josh, you want to come and uh, taste test this buffalo chicken? I will. I know you will. Oh. I thought you meant like chicken chicken. No, this is chicken chicken. No, chicken, like tween chicken. You can't put it on. You want to taste it? I know you want to. Put it on the corner. Put it on the dish, Okay. It's good. too much. I don't need all that. You don't want that much. Just a pad. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good? Let us know. Let us know what we're working with. You like it? You, you're not, you just steady eating, but you ain't saying that. I can take that one more time. One more, <laughs> one more again. A little bit. It might, I don't think daddy's gonna like this. You don't think so? I don't so you know think, you same. think you just need to eat it by yourself? I wow. Really mm, mm, mm. Okay, guys, so this is it for the Buffalo Ranch uh, chicken. We're gonna put it to the side in the refrigerator until our barbecue chicken gets ready, okay? So this is it for the Buffalo uh, Ranch. That's it for that. Now, we're gonna move on. I told you we're gonna keep this train moving. We're gonna keep this train moving. This is our um, chicken for our bacon ranch dip. Our bacon ranch dip. Of course, I've got Daisy sour cream. Now, I prefer Breakstone sour cream, but they didn't have a big enough container because I needed it for a lot of things. And so I ended up getting this, what size is this? This uh, 1.5 pound little container here. So what we're gonna do, put us some sour cream in here, right on top of, Okay, we're gonna put this 
um, sour cream right on top of our chicken here, okay? Try to put about half of this. I'm gonna put about half of it, okay? For now. I'm gonna put half of that. Got one of my packs right here. And um, all you have to do is add sour cream, and that's what we're doing. Just like that, okay? Okay, add that. I'm also going to put in some bacon bits. And I'm also going to put in some cheese. For this. Get my new spatula. So we're going to mix all this up. I like that too. Okay, guys. I'm sorry. I had a phone call. But anyway. Oh, this is so good. When I say this is good, this is good. All right. So. That's it for that. Eric tasted and what you said about it, baby. That's good. That's good? Mm-hmm. Yep. That's good. So what we're going to do now, we're going to clean up all of this here and plate this up. Well, some of it. And then we're going to wait for our chicken to get ready so we can put it on our sliders and then put them in the oven for about 15 minutes. And we're going to eat. Ooh, we. When I tell you this dip here don't want now a minute of it. Ooh, Lord have mercy, don't want not one minute. Ooh. All right. Okay. All right, so that's it for that. Um, Hold your horses. We'll be back in a minute. Okay, guys. So here are our savory butter Hawaiian rolls for our sliders. I like the savory butter uh, flavor. I've already, I've gone and sliced, um, open our sliders or our bread. And we're gonna get ready to uh, put this together. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna, I'm gonna turn our chicken off. Let me show you all what it looks like. That's our barbecue chicken. And to the side. That's our barbecue chicken. And then here's our buffalo ranch. And we're going to do six buffalo and six barbecue. How about that? All right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just put half of our barbecue right here. Like this. My God, that looks so good, Teresa. Mm-mm-mm. And then what's left, I'm going to get some uh, buns and make us a barbecue sandwich. How about that? So you can do a lot with this. Okay? So that's our barbecue side. And this is going to be our buffalo ranch side. Put it in here like this. Just like that. Can y'all see this? Can you see what I'm doing? Flip it for him here. Fill him up to the brim. Some good sliders, okay? And then I'll put a little bit more of this barbecue on here for our barbecue as well. Alright? Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put our tops back on them like that. I'm going to brush them. 
and I'm going to put them in the oven. 15 minutes on 315. You're just going to brush these tops like this with some butter. All this is is butter and parsley flakes. Okay? Butter and parsley flakes, just like this. Okay. All right, guys. As y'all can see, we got our buffalo ranch, and then we got our barbecue. We're gonna put them in the oven on 350 for 15 minutes. When I pull them out, I show you what they look like. Hold your horses. Okay, guys. We're gonna go ahead and take our um, sliders out. Mmm. There we go. These are our buffalo ranch and barbecue sliders. We're gonna sit them up here. And I'm gonna just try to, y'all hear that? Mm -mm -mm. Do you hear the crispiness? Do you hear the crispiness? Do you hear it? That's what we want right there. Look at that. That's what we want. Okay. And then I'm going to just touch them one more time. With a little bit. We're about to eat. Hold your horses. Okay, guys. We got some local chips. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull them right here in our offense side of our football. <laughs> this is the offense side. That's the offense with the chips and the defense with our bacon ranch dip. Okay? Can y'all see that? The bacon ranch, and then here are our sliders. All right, who are they? We've got buffalo ranch right here, okay. And we got defense. barbecue right here. This is defense, and this is offense. Then we're gonna see who gonna win the game. That part right there. You know, they said the offense win the game. Uh huh. Defense, offense, offense is on my side where the barbecue is. Well, we're gonna hold down the defense. She ain't gonna score no points on this. Okay, we're we gonna see about that. All right, you want. That's your buffalo. And you want one of the barbecue too? Yep. Okay. We'll give you an offense and a defense. There you go. Can y'all see that good barbecue in there? All right. And then I'm going to get my barbecue right here. I don't do spice. It sure looks good though. I'm gonna just do this barbecue right here. All right, those are mine. And we'll put these to the side, like that, for now. And you want some dip? Hey, y'all. Yeah, yes. Put you some dip right there. Like that, and put me a little dip right here like that. Let's get you some chips, sir. Let's get me a few chips. There we go. All right. So that's my barbecue sliders right there with some bacon ranch dip and ruffle chips. This is a, a Super Bowl lunch that you all could do. And then this is Eric's Buffalo Ranch with his, his um, bacon ranch dip and ruffles. All right, sir. Let's get into it. Father God, we thank you for this food that we're about to receive. Let it be nourishment for our body. We thank you for the one and my wife who prepared it, God. Let it do us no harm in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. It's the dip for me. 
I'm telling y'all, with these ring um, with these ruffles, this is so good, so so good with the ruffles. Mm 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 mm. All right, that's our barbecue slider. So good. And this so is good. This is the buffalo slider. And y'all, this was a very simple and easy uh, meal for Super Bowl Sunday. Here you go. Mm. The heat sneak up on you, but it's a good sandwich. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So if y'all like this video, please leave us a comment. And let us know what you're going to be doing for Super Bowl Sunday. What you prepared for your family. How mm -hmm. many guests came over. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if you if you like want to try this, give us a thumbs up. If you're not a member of our family, please consider uh, being one. Please. And we appreciate you. I always thank my wife for preparing this wonderful meal. So... <laughs> We're going to get off of here and eat the rest of our lunch mm -hmm. for today. So, and we got a few videos coming out back to back leading on up to uh, Super Bowl Sunday. So, until the next video, let the journey continue. Bye, guys. Bye.